Hey, Janet. Jenny, that little deer was real cute. Pooping all over the yard. The little deer. even good, I might go so far as to say. Before I started stream, I was having a really, really bad run that I decided to reset in Dry Canyon because I missed a gem. And I noticed that even though it was really bad, I was feeling pretty good. So I figured I would try streaming it instead of, uh, instead of doing it offline. I lost, like... 30 seconds in Dark Hollow in that run because I died right after getting the key here, which respawns the Norks in the tunnels, and uh, and also I just messed up a bunch of other stuff. But I felt fine and kept it going, so I thought, hey, maybe it's time to try to stream it. Because I, I do generally prefer my PBs be on stream than offline. So it's nice when I when I can be in the mood to, to stream a difficult category like this. That's give me the gem. There we go. Oh my god. Oh my god, please. <laughs> frog. These frogs, oh my god. God, what a lamp hop that was. That was crazy. That was very, very forward and not very up. Split a tiny bit early, but whatever. But anyway, yeah, so I, um, I, I don't think I'm going to do well tonight. I, I'm not, I know this run is starting well, apparently, but I, I'm, I'm not feeling like I'm going to play super well. I mostly just want to finish a run. Hoping for, like, maybe around 145. My average segments these days are, like, a high 145. 
Although that's a high 145 skewed with a good artisans. Not even a good artisans. Skewed with, I think, a better artisans than it should be. Um, just because I was going on a stretch there for a while where I was resetting a lot. A good start, though. I don't usually have starts this good. Yeah, 145.53 is my average. Come on. Oh, ah, crud, crud. Ooh, ooh, did I? Might have missed a, one of those. We'll find out in a minute. Uh, no, that's everything. That's only six, and that's a hundred. Yeah, uh, get in there. That was really funny. I hit the vortex, and that automatically ticked the gem counter up to 100, and then I fell out of it. I, I've never seen that before. That was really funny. Heck, is this best pace? Just barely. Look at that. Neat. I still doubt I'll keep it up, just because, again, I don't feel like I'm playing well. I'm just... I just haven't made any major mistakes yet. Hey, Bagel. Thank you for the good luck. Hope you're doing well, Bagelman. Hey, Toop. Toop, I was lurking in your stream a little bit earlier. Uh, is there any reason you're doing all skill points right now? Or were you just looking for some other category to run? Awesome bagel. Grats. Uh, which Lego Batman category? Hey man, like just getting frustrated, that's fair. Good for sure. I feel like this room can be done faster because of this red. No. Definitely faster than this, but that red gem. Usually you go back for that red gem anyway, and the. I don't know, something feels off about that. 100%. Nice! Long showing. Well, congrats, Bagel. Big congrats. You'll have to let me know when that is. Good stone hill, too. Very much my best pace. How about that? names in chat. That's actually funny. Bagel, Tooper, and Manly, your names are all such similar colors, but they're also all slightly different. Oop. There we go. Three to eight? Ooh boy. Yeah, fun. Hey, 
CC. Purple gang rise up. CC, watching you play Ape Escape again has kind of made me want to do another run of it. I realized the other day I never submitted the one run that I did to the leaderboard, so uh, it's been on my mind a bit. We got an extra life now. Ooh, okay. I was a little worried about what I just did. I, I played it really risky. If that bull hit me, that would have just been run over. You can go into zombie on that dragon really easily. Bagel, thank you for the sub. Yay. Big yay. Um... Hey, let's not beef the rest of Artisans. You guys can't tell, but my blood pressure just kind of spiked. <gasps> oh my god! Oh my god, did we finally do it? Ladies and gentlemen, the first sub-13 Sparksless Artisans. <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh, I don't care how the rest of this run goes. That's been a goal of mine for so long. I've been running this category, what, like two months now? And I should have been able to sub-13 like any run this whole time. I've just been messing up something every run. Ah, oh, Hell yeah. I'm gonna highlight just that Artisans after this stream. Assuming this doesn't PB, and if it does PB, I'm gonna highlight the whole run. Do it again? No. Oh, that's good, cat. Yes, everyone else, please have a low blood pressure. Help balance us out. Just though. I gotta fly faster. I'm trying. I'm trying. <sighs> like, no, your heart rate's too low. <laughs> Hard and I don't know why I still go for it. 
It's not hard. It's just really easy to mess up, which doesn't matter in normal runs because you can save it, but in Sparksless runs, it's just time loss. It's just a lot of time loss. But I go for it anyway because it looks cool. <sighs> okay, I'm feeling better. All of your collective heart rates can rise again. I'm, I'm doing better now. Get out of here. instead of orange, so you can say it's more bagel colored. Very nice. Ooh, that stinks. I've been messing up a lot of charge collides recently. I thought it might have been my controller dropping inputs. And I, I did open my controller yesterday and cleaned it and it was disgusting in there. I think that was the right call. But I think some of the dropped inputs are just me messing up. Oops, no. Get him. Oh my god. That was really bad. I've never missed that bird that way that many times. Give me that. <laughs> no, come on. Okay, mediocre dry canyon, but that's fine. Okay, Hangman. I expected this run to be really bad, and then I got the first ever sub-13 artisans, so... Going alright. It's now Glyvedown. Oh, I hope Glyvedown goes well. I've been messing up Glyvedown a lot recently. The... Messed up charge glides have not been helping here. <clears throat> you know, 12 seconds is not that bad for the uh, the mistakes I made in that Dry Canyon. I'm, I'm fine with that. This one in particular, I keep falling into that river right there. I think that's happened like three of the last five times I've gotten to Clifftown. I've, I've messed up the charge glide and, uh, and fallen in the river. Hey, flames. Okay, sure. 
I've also just been having trouble flaming lately. I don't know what it is. The flames are where I really felt the dropped inputs were happening. The charge glides were annoying, but yeah, there's another one. That feels normal, I definitely hit circle, but no flame. So who knows? On Matrix? Uh, yeah, I'm using a, uh, it's not permadeath. I'm just using a game hack to lock my health at zero. So any hit will just kill me. Oops. Oops. There we go. Uh, but death works the same. If you if you take a hit, you just die and respawn. Uh, but the big thing is because I don't have sparks, I need to collect all the gems manually. Really? He went over me. That bird predicted me. World record is just a little bit over hour 40. I think it's like an hour 40, 23 seconds by Hamilton or something like that. And my goal is sub 140. Nope. Yeah, this is a pretty bad cliff town. It's not the worst, it's just a lot of small things. But those small things add up quite a bit. But I mean, it's, it's fine. I'm still doing fine. <laughs> Should start losing time any second here, though. Yeah, there it is. I'm honestly surprised I'm not losing more time. This was not good. Yeah, about 10 seconds. Yeah, sub 140 with PS1 loads and no credit skip. Oh, that's not... Nope, turn the... Get off... Oh my god. I haven't missed this box in a long time. That's really unfortunate. That's really bad. Oh well. Why no credit skip? I just don't want to. I want it to be as comparable to my normal 120 runs as I can. And in my normal 120 runs, I don't do credit skip, and I play with PS1 loads and don't turn the music off, so... Same rules here. Nice. Flaming that mom out of the side is a little precise, but it saves a little time. Okay, we're fine. That's unfortunate. That's unfortunate. But it's fine. Again, I didn't... I said this at the start of the stream. I don't expect a PB tonight. I've been playing really bad all the time. I just want to finish a run. That's all I care about. <sighs> Lucas didn't sub 140 with credit skip and with FDS, but Lucas also did not have flame charging, which saves many minutes over the run. So there's that. Yeah, Toop knows. Lucas also knows that. <laughs> He's well aware of that. Lucas also is a very good rocket power speed runner, so I'm not trying to knock him.
Let's see if I can get the fancy strat for the uh, the window gem here. I want to jump and then bonk. Oh, not quite. If you do it just right, you can bonk so that you recoil into the gem that's sitting there. But it's it's a little hard. It's a little weird. This is actually a really fun little sparks list. The way the gems are laid out, there's a lot of interesting movement you do. Those stairs are also harder sparksless. God, any second now, with these jumps, I just feel like... <sighs> that works too. Never mind. I was gonna say, I feel like at any point I'm just going to accidentally jump off the cliff. That... I should have gotten that. Why did... why? But no, that was equally as dumb a mistake. That's too far forward. Really? Didn't get either of those? Oh my god. Oh, this is all very bad. I don't even know where all these gems are. Can't see any of them. There we go. I started doing this section differently, and I think it's probably for the best. Oh my god. Okay, sure. As much as I like uh, jumping up here and then running backwards around, uh, oops. I, I do think that's that's a better way to go about it. I normally... okay. I don't know why that didn't hit the guy the first time, but we're fine. There we go. That's not too much time lost for a death. Some levels, you die in the wrong place and you lose, like, a minute at least, so... I'll take that. We'll see. Uh, probably yes, but we'll see. Because the other thing is, um... I have a lot of room for gold on a lot of levels still. There are a bunch of levels that I just haven't done very well a single time. <laughs> because they're hard. And I probably won't gold them this run, but I might. You never know. You just don't know. Why? Why? <laughs> Uh, yeah, 
I did get that. Okay. Good bonk. Quality bonk right there. level. I actually golded the other day by like six more seconds. Hey, now. Nice. What? Okay, hold on. Okay, sure. Oh god. <laughs> These gems, I swear. curve there so often. I feel like I charge in a straight line, but the game just turns me on its own. There's something in the scenery there that I think I'm just not really picking up on. Sarah. The Pander Sarah? Pander, you, uh, you really hit me with the David Byrne fever again. Um, I was listening to the True Stories soundtrack, uh, before starting stream. That one's real good. Uh, I gave a listen to everything that happens will happen today. I, I've never really tried listening to that one before. That's been really good. I listened to American Utopia again, and I like it a lot more than this, this time. I think the reason I couldn't really get into it before was I think that I Dance Like This is the worst song on that album. It's like the only one that I don't like very much. And so starting off with the worst song on the album did not really help me appreciate the rest of it. <laughs> I don't think it's bad, I just, I, eh. It just doesn't really work for me. But I liked the rest of it. So yeah, thank you for doing that, I guess. <laughs> Thank you for reminding me that there's a person that I like in the world. <laughs> An artist that I like. say that was a decent start. <laughs> need to reroute 100% again? I feel like you need to keep rerouting it. 
I feel like the last couple of times I've seen you going at 100%, it was you needing to reroute it because a bunch of new stuff was found. Or at least I remember one significant time that that happened. Wasn't there some major, major, major glitch that was found in the last year, maybe? Like, that just kind of fundamentally changed how the game goes? I, I don't remember what it was. I just remember there being something really big. Yeah, that was really dumb. No, give me that green. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, why did I jump there? Oh, I've also been listening to more Brian Eno. Um, I I appreciated what Brian Eno did with ambient music, but I've never really found a situation where I wanted to listen to it. But I've been listening to it recently while working. I've found that as a really nice time to listen to it. So I'm happy to have finally found a reason to enjoy that. Oh no, that's really bad. Uh, uh ooh, this is terrible. Oh god, maybe? Maybe. Oh, we're amazing! Oh, we're amazing. It's okay, guys, we're amazing. It's fine, we're fine. Do a shemp trick there and pick up those two gems before going up there. Got that from Shempum D, the genius. Two years ago, which had the infinite fly glitch. Yeah, it might have been that, actually. Might have been... I think it was the infinite fly glitch, yeah. And it was just longer ago than I remembered. Because what even is time? Get a few red bricks, nice. Pepsi. <laughs> Thank you, Pepsi. I do want to become famous. I better go to that link. Pepsi, grats on being the best heads run runner. That game is really cool. You you find good games. I don't I feel like I don't tell you that enough. Like between Heads Run and the SpongeBob plug and play and Tori 3D. You just you find good stuff. Oh my god. I have not actually. 
I've wanted to. I love Ape 1 so much, but I've never played the other ones. I'd really like to give them a try sometime. Because I know there were a bunch. Um, hey camera. You wanna catch up, buddy? Oh, that's Spyro versus Spyro. That worked. I don't know why I was worried about that, that was fine. Uh, hey camera, again. You wanna... You wanna catch up a bit? I've been messing up this level really bad a lot recently, so I'm happy this went okay. It's all through other people. I mean, that happens. consider that a form of you surrounding yourself with good people who know good games. <laughs> Mine cool stuff, and then Ape 3 extends it further, I see. I got all the gems, right? Okay, <laughs> good. I mean, I think also to an extent, it's what you pick up on. Like, sure, you're finding out about the games through other sources, but there are also probably a lot of games we all hear about that we just immediately forget about. So you're just good at finding good ones and actually taking notice of them. Seven lives. That's ridiculous. Nobody needs that many lives. Maybe a cat, but I'm not a cat, I'm a dragon. At the very least, I'm a dog, but I'm not a cat. Don't need seven lives. It's really fun to try to catch those gem sparks list, but it's kind of hard. <laughs> I'm not gonna try to explain that one. I don't know what happened. We're moving on. Oh, I wanted to get that thing.
Yeah, this isn't bad. Mid 46, sure. Why not? know exactly what I did wrong there to make me bonk, and I feel silly for doing it. Oh no! Oh my god, that gem! Sometimes you just can't hit gems. Doesn't work. Also having a lot of pivots this level, which is bothering me. How did I catch that? <laughs> oh my god, I'll get that later. That's fine. That's fine. I can't catch that though. should have taken the, the first big guy's gem instead of going back for it. It's a little tricky to get both of the big guy's gems and then charge into the little guy there at the end, but, uh, but getting the first big gem is not hard, and I should have done that. I just... I wanted to play it safe. I recently had a, a dumb, bad death there in a run, so I guess I was still worried about that. Oh, that flame was beautiful. Oh my god. I wish I had taken a better line there. That was gorgeous. That was like exactly how to do that bridge. Bridge, that log, whatever you want to call it.
It's a little precise to snipe that uh, that fifth plane with the same flame you get with the chest, but uh, but it saves a couple of seconds if you do. So I'm glad I did. Oops. Okay, sure. That might be fine. Yeah, that's fine. Getting the gems under the whirlwind sparkless is also a little funky, but it worked. It's fine. We're fine. It's okay. That. Okay. I was going for the instant load, but whatever. about that. Okay, that frog was going way away from me. Sure. Sure. I'm not gonna worry about it. Ooh, okay, we're fine. We're fine. This is a scary level. I just want to get through it. That's all I care about. One sparksless vortex? What am I doing? That's not... Uh, sparksless vortex is as soon as someone makes it an interesting category. <laughs> but I don't see it being an interesting category anytime soon, so never. about Sparkless Vortex. There's not much danger in Vortex runs. There's some. You might die some places, but for the most part, if you're on a decent run, you're not taking damage anywhere. So all Sparkless Vortex does, in my mind, is just takes away your options for movement. It means you can't damage boost anywhere, which makes the run strictly less interesting to me. I don't need that life. I have so many lives. I'm so used to runs where I'm doing really poorly and I've already died like four times that I just keep grabbing more lives. It's fine. Maybe I'll have a decent tree tops and not have to grab a bunch of extra lives there like I normally do. Uh, it's the same reason I'm not really interested in Pal Vortex. There are a bunch of tricks that just kind of don't work in Pal, and I don't care about that then. And there's nothing new that does work in Pal that doesn't work in NTSC. So I just, I'm just not really interested in it. That wasn't bad. It wasn't great. There was a lot of slop in there, but it wasn't bad. Hey, we're on PB pace. How about that? No telling how long that'll last. Don't get your hopes up. But we are, so that's neat. No, Pell has other issues that make it less interesting. Like, you jump higher and move faster in Pell. 
It's just that you're also heavier, so proxies and damage boosts just don't send you very high. Oh, hell in general, yeah. Also not true of Jersey Devil, where PAL is basically a beta of the game. <laughs> first try. Let's go. I've been having trouble getting that lately. I'm happy I did that. God. I've been missing Stone Knot a ton lately, too. Super happy to get that. Hello. Thank God. Sub our treetops. Let's go. my first sub-hour treetops, but very good. I forgot to go for the thing. Whatever. Doesn't matter. It's weird movement choices there, but whatever. <laughs> Thirteen artisans this run. None of the rest of this matters. I don't care that I just died there. I got sub thirteen artisans this run. Also, I don't care that I just died there because it's not a very bad death. Okay, please. I'm losing way more time to bad movement in this level than I am to that death. Losing way more time to the fact that I kind of really need to pee than I am to that death. Yeah, I'm gonna be happy when this runs over. <laughs> oh.
Oh yeah, I watched the credits. I'll have plenty of time to pee. It is in like 30 minutes time, but that's better than uh, than if it were in like 34 minutes time. Not even 20 seconds. Shoutouts to me being bad at estimating things. <laughs> Entering Greenweavers with a best possible time, still sub 140. <laughs> Amazing. Never thought I'd see the day. Time for the split where it's really easy to lose, like, multiple minutes. <laughs> the first spot where I can lose a bunch of time. Uh, okay. I normally just a little bit go for the game crash right there, but this is actually a good run, so I don't want to do that. Ooh, nope, not quite. It's a very tall jump, but uh, not quite where I wanted to go. Golf! We're actually on a good run. That's my PB comparison. <laughs> For the first time in weeks, we're on a good run. That said, I'm gonna go back to comparing to averages. that was. I've been getting away with a lot of weird movement this run. I, I don't know why. There's been a lot where, like, in a lot of other places in the game, if I had done that, it would have been really bad, and I would have lost a bunch of time. But because I happened to do it where I did, I it was just, like, a one-second time loss. That's true golf. It would no longer be a good run if that happens.
cut the important gems in there. Don't know why I grabbed that. I don't need more lives. I'm gonna grab this one because it's free, but I don't need more lives. What? Oh, come on. We didn't have the guy fall through the floor. Officially, and at least okay, Haunted Towers. start. Did you start that, uh, that truck driving game? Oh, Skyrim. Yeah, you are late to the party. That's fine, I was late too. I think I started my first real Skyrim playthrough like two years ago or something. Yeah, that's a fun game. Skyrim. That's a fun game. That's my review. God, how am I not a professional game critic yet? Something really funny happened in this level during an offline run the other day, by the way. Uh, keen sparksless observers may remember we get zombied in this level. On the. Oh, I hate that. On Azizi, the second dragon coming up here. Um, in an offline run I did the other day, uh, I messed up the zombie. I just completely forgot to go for it. But instead, uh, I accidentally got zombied on the dragon after this, which I'd never done before and completely forgot you could do. <laughs> So that was just funny. Wouldn't it be nice if the kind of zombie you got from dying on a dragon also stopped you from bonking? Make this strat even better. Why do I zombie here? It makes you invincible. Uh, so you just don't need to worry about the enemies. <laughs> That's all. Theoretically, it actually loses time to be doing this. Uh, it's just that... This level is really hard, and I think the time that you lose is worth the safety of definitely not dying for the rest of it. It lets me just play the rest of this level super risky if I want, because there is no risk. Out of here. You do get to charge the fireworks box. That's a fun part. The only scary thing is uh, there's a chance you'll soft lock the game if you make some bad moves. So you gotta be careful about that. So you have to be careful a little bit, but you 
don't have to be careful. Hello. You don't have to be careful in a lot of other ways. That ends up really nice. Um, the other side effect of zombie is that we are still zombie right now, so we need to die before going into the next level. So I collect this dragon and then jump off the cliff. And the only way we can die is by voiding out, since we can't take damage on anything. So we need to just fall long enough that it respawns us. Hello, get the box. Thank you. Oh, we're way ahead. Nice. Technically, the other comparison I'm looking at isn't PB, it's best split times, but it's effectively the same thing. I think starting in Magic Crafters, my PB splits are my best split times for the rest of the run, so. still fine. I, I'm not complaining. I know it may sound an awful lot like I'm complaining, but I swear I'm not. <laughs> it is insane to me that I'm on a run like this. Also, I was doing a slightly different lofty route for a few runs there, but I, I don't think it's worth it. I'm going to go back to my other one. that flame charge. 
a bunch of runs recently. I'm not sure why. Honestly, I've been missing a bunch of fan chest flame charges lately, and I have no clue why. They're not hard. It's just a matter of a little bit of positioning. For some reason, I've just been... Just been slightly off. don't need the lives, oh my god. Stop going for extra lives. Oh, golf, why? Disappointing how? I was looking at chat to see how disappointing the pizza was and I almost bonked into a wall. guys. I hope you're happy. I would say that's the last one you're getting, but honestly I can't guarantee that. There are a few lives that are really easy to run into. There we go. That was a fine lofty. <laughs> all lives. What? Oh my god. <laughs> Yeah, when I said I've, I've been feeling like I've just been playing bad recently, it's stuff like that. I've been missing a bunch of flame charges, I've been pivoting a lot more, I don't know. I just feel like I haven't been playing all that well lately. And I stand by that. The only reason this run is going well is because there hasn't been anything major that I've messed up. I don't know. Yeah, the reason that I haven't been able to PB for a while is because I just keep having runs where I lose, like, more than a minute on several levels, and that hasn't happened yet in this game, in this run. Hence PB possibility. But my overall gameplay has not been amazing. There's been a lot of mistakes kinda everywhere. There hasn't been losing more than a minute on a bunch of levels, but there's been a bunch of levels where I lost, like, 15 seconds. Which is not good. Cool. 
far back. That was also far back. What am I doing? Hey, Ragey. stairs lose a minute that way. Hey. Oh my god. Oh my god, please. Oh no. Oh, that's terrible. Because that's... Yeah, I can't get up there now. Okay. Here it is, golf. I'm trying. I'm trying for you. Yeah. I, I can't. I need to just go back here. I haven't been able to get up that. That's like... That's like a 30 second time loss. Big time loss here. Oh my god. I'm so bad at getting doubles on those chests for some reason. It is kind of funny, yeah. Yeah, but Nasty still only has 125 gems, whereas Jock has 175. Oh, wait, no he doesn't. No, Jock only has 100. Those 75 at the end are, uh, not part of him. Manly, come on. Get your Spyro lore right. <laughs> Unless you mean in the level as a whole, in case, yeah, I think that is true. No, he only has four. There's three purples... purples. There's three pinks up by the vortex, and four that he drops. It's four. That's a very important number to know for any percent routing. now. Uh, no, Nasty's one and then four.
Whoa, okay. Gotta remind myself, I didn't think I was gonna PB coming into this run. I really thought this was gonna be like a 145 or something. So I should not be upset about however the rest of this goes. You, whoever started the poll. Glad I have good moderators. Hey, now. God, I'm gonna lose so much time here. Give me the stuff. Why? What? <laughs> Good poll options. <sighs> it's okay, guys. We're not gonna PB. You don't have to worry anymore. I'm pretty sure it's gonna die. Technically I can, I'm not sure I will. Um, that's gonna kill the run. I think I'm gonna die in loot and need to go get all the keys again. I think that's what's gonna kill it. Fart. Almost had a good start to the level. Honestly, it could be any number of things. The last few levels of this have a lot of points of failure. Could be any of the enemies in Twilight Harbor. told me I should go for magic stairs there, but getting a flame charge on that guy with magic stairs seems tough. Thank you, Golf and Pander, for believing in me. <laughs> Thank you, whoever started that poll. I think what's gonna kill the run is the credits are gonna start and I'm gonna get up to use the bathroom and then I'm gonna fall asleep in the bathroom and uh, just not finish. I think. That's my guess.
Uh, hello. More missed flame charges, man. Compare to PB at this point. <laughs> My nervous system collapsing? Who knows? I live a very unhealthy life. I could just go into the bathroom and then die. <laughs> you never know. Nothing. Let's go. If you don't get that thief there, he's kinda hard to get while still getting all the rest of the gems. Nope, get the gems. Get all of the gems. Thank you. Okay, let's see about these nasty gems. I say let's see, I know the answer. <laughs> You have 375 when you get to the door, you hit Nasty once and he drops a 25, you hit Nasty again he drops 425s. I say you have 375. It's hard to say, given my gem count is speeding up, but I should have 400 right now. Yeah. Oh! This level has the same number of gems as Jock's level does. They're both 500. Cool. I'll be right back.
yourself, do you not have your toilet in the wardrobe? It's 2021 golf. <laughs> It was so hard to not just do poverty credit skip and take world record. Because <laughs> if I did it, this would have been world... Assuming loot goes well, this would have been world record. Oh my god, Panda, that's beautiful. Uh, okay. Still don't know how to do that. That was surprisingly good gem collection. Sub 140 loot. Hey, now. Not good. That's not good at all. Didn't need to go that high. Hell yeah, I want to be famous. Look at this, guys. We can be famous during a Sparksless PB. <laughs> that bot was just trying to cheer me on in its own way. And now it's banned from my channel forever. fine. Yeah. How did I nearly gold that? Have I seriously not done loot that well? Well, okay. Well, PB. Tiny PB. PB when I was ahead by well over a minute earlier. Also, Sub-13 Artisans. Let's go. <sighs> Ragey ding. Nice. 
Seriously, sub-13 artisans is a much bigger accomplishment to me than a PB. <laughs> It was like five runs in, I realized, hey, I could totally sub 13 artisans, any run now. And it's been like a hundred attempts later and it finally happened. <laughs> Depends on what you mean by peaked. I don't think... Oh, with sub-13 artisans? Maybe. <laughs> I don't know that I'm gonna get another one. It's surprisingly hard to not mess up anything in artisans. Um... Oh, this PB also has land pop, which is nice. Um... What was I about to say? Oh, I don't think I'm going to get much better at anything in this run. I think if I want to get sub 140, I just need to have a run where I don't mess up. I don't have any big mistakes. Because let's, let's look at uh, best things here. I lost... How much time? I lost... About a minute in Nork Cove. About 40 seconds in Jacques. 13 seconds in, in Lofty, that didn't help anything. It goes like... Other than that, it was mostly just smaller things. But still a lot of like 10 plus second losses, which aren't good. <laughs> That's really bad. Ghostly, we PB'd by a few seconds. Um... If it mutes the music... Oh yeah, Ice Cavern, I lost like 30 seconds there. If it mutes the music and does credit skip... I don't know. Probably a sub-135. Easily sub-135. What am I saying? Oh my god, the far and away that. Maybe like... Maybe like a 130. Nice, ghostly. Very nice. Okay, well, I'm... I'm happy I PB'd, I guess. I'm kind of surprised. I was just looking for a resetless run. I'll take a PB. <sighs> yeah, by just a little bit. I was much, much further ahead uh, earlier in the run, but I, st I still PB'd, so. Can't be too upset with that. Sorry, my hands are just stiff, and I'm figuring out what I want to do. Because I'm thinking... I'm not doing another run. I, I don't want to do that. But I'm considering doing more. More something. Yeah. Yeah, let's, let's. <sighs> 